Jonathan Lee Riches investigates. Where is 32-year-old Chelsea Grin? Chelsea Grin lived in San Diego, went on a road trip. On her way from San Diego to Connecticut to attend a wedding and she vanished, disappeared around the end of September. Somewhere in the Williams, Ash Fork area of Arizona. Where could she be? Her car was later found, abandoned on a remote road, tires flat, car doors locked. She vanished. She had a little like iguana, which she caught a pet dragon named Roxy with her. That's gone. Her pet is gone. Sleeping bag, gone. Wallet, gone. But where is she? Now, I want to show you something according to her public Facebook post. She has ties according to her Facebook that she used to live in Arizona. That's what she said on her Facebook. That's what she said on her Facebook. Desert Hills, Arizona. Check this out. So this is the public Facebook profile of Chelsea Grimm. This is her Facebook here. And I want to show you something on her Facebook. Uh, here it says she studied New York University from San Diego, single. She lists her Instagram account. Uh, photos of her here. Let me just show you. But I want to show you something on her profile. I want to show you something. So going back here to the about section and then places lived. And she has San Diego, Stanford, San Diego, Brookline, Massachusetts, Desert Hills, Arizona. And that piqued my interest. Devil Hills, Arizona. Some place where she lived. Chelsea. So let's talk a little bit more about Desert Hills, Arizona. Now, this is Google Maps. This red location here is where her vehicle was found. The vehicle was found here north of Ash Fork, and look, Desert Hills, Arizona, about three hours away. I-40, over to Kingman, south on I-40, Desert Hills. So on her Facebook, she says she lived in Desert Hills at one point, wondering if she's hiding out or in Desert Hills Arizona right now. What do you think? Considering her vehicle was found 170 miles away, easy access, I-40. Did she hitch a ride with anyone? Did someone pick her up? Is she just hiding out? Or is there something more to this? Or is this nothing of nothing? It is kind of far, 170 miles, but according to her Facebook, she says she lived here. Desert Hills, right on the Arizona-California border. Very, very interesting. Let me know what you think. So Desert Hills, Arizona, three hours away from where her car was found. What do you think? Think she could be somewhere in the Desert Hills, Arizona area with a friend, an associate? Who'd she live with? If she lived in Desert Hill, she might not have. Some people just put places they've been on Facebook and lived at and tied to where they have no ties whatsoever. They might like just like the name and say Desert Hills. I'm going to list that I've been there or used to live there. If she did live there, was it with a guy, girl, by herself, apartment, house, trailer, tent, property? Chelsea Grimm is missing. It's a public interest case. People are looking for her. 32 years old. Where could she be? Somewhere in Arizona? Ventured off. Went to Phoenix. Supposedly met a friend there. And then jotted north. 
try to get into a hotel with using euros and then had a police encounter at a cemetery where she was going to do some photography work at nighttime. She was crying, distraught. What's going on here, people? I am covering the Chelsea Graham case. If you know where she's at, contact authorities immediately. Is she alive or not? Is she a victim of foul play or not? Is this a hoax? Some people speculate this could be a hoax. What do you think? I'll be reading the comments. We will talk soon. Stay tuned.